Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Sunday the 21st of January 2024. I hope you are keeping well, about to have a great Sunday, whether it's a relaxing day, an exciting day, whatever it is that you normally like to do. Let's hope it's a good one. And uh, if it's not Sunday when you're watching this, well, have a good day, whatever day it is. Um, I was thinking when Johnny Cash sang that song, it burns, burns, burns the ring of fire. He definitely had some very spicy food the evening before. And Johnny, I feel for you this morning. <laughs> no more said about that. Right. What's happening in Germany? Some good news um, because uh, thousands, thousands, uh, 100,000 or some, some estimates up to a quarter of a million people have taken to the streets to demonstrate against... Uh, discussions by the far right to to um, deport uh, immigrants who they don't like. And uh, so it's always good to see that our fellow humans are humane. Uh, let's get on with the game of Sudoku. Now, this is the Observer's Puzzle because it's a Sunday. The Guardian doesn't print and the Observer doesn't tell us which level it thinks it is. So I shall have put uh, a link, uh, sorry, a title at the beginning of this. Um, explaining what level I think it is, and you can disagree with me. At the moment, though, I have absolutely no idea what level it is, but I'm not going to bother to explain the rules. If it turns out to be an absolute beginner level and you've never played Sudoku before, well, I'll tell you, check out tomorrow's Monday game. Or uh, if I play the game tomorrow, any Monday, go back in time, which you can do with with um, YouTube, and check out any easy games. Right, okay, so I'm going to start with a 7 there, and also the 7 blocking like this here and there's seven across here and across there so that's going to put seven there and seven up and across and seven down which is not a drink goes there uh, and that's the sevens over and out thank you sevens now i can see the four blocking across here and down here so that's going to put four into that square and the four blocking across here and now the four up here will give us four in that square there uh, fours down here across and down means that that's a four. Fives blocking across here like this and a five down gives us five in this square here. If by any chance you hear the sound of an alarm, it means my bread is cooked and I can take it out of the oven. So I might have a short delay. It's possible there'll be a short delay in this game. If I have to, uh, if it turns out to be a long game, a tricky game or something, and I have to go and remove some bread from the oven. Nines block like this, that gives me a nine there. And nine blocking this square, this square, this square, and this square. That that one there, I mean. So in this row, that's the location of nine. Uh, six blocks this square here. We need a six in this column. It will have to fit there. And this will be a two to finish the column. Three blocks across here, that puts a three into that square there. So we're left with one and eight in these squares. That means these squares over here will have to be uh, two and six. So uh, can we say which is which? No, but it puts twos down here and it puts sixes down there. Uh, 
Uh, let's try that again. So this is two six. Is there anything over here? Nines? No, that's not much use. Uh, a one is one of our missing digits here, so this can't be a one. That's going to be a one, and the missing number here is an eight. Uh, three missing numbers up here are two, five, eight, so this will be a six. Okay, we have five blocking across here and we have nine blocking across here and we have five and nine blocking down here. So we know that's a pair of five and nine. Is that going to mean anything? Don't know, but at least we know that these squares have to be two or three. So when the two blocks here, that will give us two there and three in that square there. Um, which will give us threes in those squares. Ah, three up here, three across here, and three up here. That means that's a three. And now we've got three blocking this square, this square, this square, and this square. So that's three in that column there. And three is in one of these two squares blocking down three across here and across there. So three in that square there. Missing numbers across here are one, eight and nine. We've got one and nine in the same column. So that would be an eight. Two blocking down here and here puts the two into that square there. Four blocking up to the top here puts four into that square, four across here and across here. And up there puts four into that square. That's the last four. Down the bottom here, we still need a six. Let's put that in. Okay, um, we have eight blocking across. Wait a minute, wait a minute, that's my, maybe not right. I take that back. I was about to say something that wouldn't be true, so that's no good, is it? Uh, what's missing from here? Five and nine. 
So this is one and three. Any help on that? No, not yet. Oh, well, I've hit a pause. I was about, I was earlier, um, a moment ago, I was about to say this must be an easy level, but um, I've suddenly hit a pause, so I think it's elevated itself to medium level, I suspect. Um, or maybe not. Six blocks up here and six blocks across there. There's our six. Uh, one blocks this square, eight blocks this square, so this has to be one and eight here, and this will be five. Five blocks down here, here's our five. And missing digit here is a nine. Nine blocks down here, here's our nine. Missing number here is one. One across here, and one across there. Puts one into that square. And uh, we know this was 2 and 6, don't we? So this will have to be uh, 8 and 9. So the 9 blocking down here, there's the 9, there's the 8. One blocking up here puts one into that square. One across here and across here means that's a one. Uh, three blocks across here, there's our three. Two there, two across here and across there, there's our two. Missing digit here is six. Last number to place here is um, three. Three, four, seven, nine are done. Six blocks this square here, so that's our six. This will be two. Two at the end of this column here, and two across here, and across here. Puts two there. The last number to get here is an eight. Um, we still need one number here. That's a five, I think. And five blocks across here, giving us five in that square. Missing number here, eight. Eight back that way puts an eight here. This is a one, I know. One across here, there's our one. And the last number is a six. So is it an easy, is it a medium? I'm going to leave it up to you. I'm not sure if that's an easy game or a medium game, but I don't think it goes much above that unless I'm mistaken. Or I fluked it or something like that. But anyway, you can decide, I think. I'll leave it as easy slash medium. <laughs> I'm hedging my bets today. Bye-bye.